to be consistent. We're going to our first match oh, yeah, on Battlefield. On Battlefield. Yep. Um, so we'll see how these players exactly like to play it. It looks like thumbs way up. He, he, I, I, it looks like he kind of wants to just get in there. He doesn't want to give her space. At least that's what we see so far. Oh. Yeah, so what I'm, what I'm seeing is um, an important thing to note when you're playing a Jigglypuff with someone who's like a fast faller is like, obviously don't get off stage. You can get really oh, easily. Oh yeah, don't get off stage. So um, what you do is you look, all right, is this a Puff like someone who likes to do a short hop, someone who likes to do like go higher in the air? It seems like Agla likes to stay a little bit yeah, higher. He He'll do like a full hop and then a second jump. And so far, Thumbs Way Up has been trying to scoop underneath of him to punish that. I'm on, I didn't exactly see. Has, been, he, has he been trying to use up air at all? Uh, he used knee. He was trying up air a couple times there, yeah. Okay, okay. But it looks like um, Akla catches on so fast. You see, he's oh, like, yeah, he's, so you saw he like full hops to sort of like get Thumbs to want to come and then fade it away with the back air so that if Thumbs did try to come in, he would get hit. Get a face full of back air. Exactly. And, um, we're, and we'll, let's keep an eye on like how the interplay works throughout the game because these players are so good. I'm sure it's going to change over and over. Absolutely. See, right now he's just take he's off stage. He has no reason to get on, except he did, and now he takes a uh, knee to the face. Yeah, down third knee. Um, not guaranteed against a lot of characters, but dang, it works so often versus Jigglypuff, and it oh, kills yeah. so early. Puff's so light. You can, I mean, there are like tons of different ways that you can jump as Falcon to cover like uh, down third knee on Puff, especially above like seventy percent. Yeah, I really like below seventy percent. He she usually can just grab, get onto a platform. Like you just saw there. It really even looks like when Thumbs above uh, is above Aglet here, um, he's taking advantage of the fact that despite having like five or six jumps, depending on how you look at it, um, Puff does not really have great vertical mobility. It oh, takes him forever not. to keep jumping up. So when uh, Thumbs way up is either above or below Puff, he'll far and make sure that he's not a, like a horizontal angle. So at the very worst, they trade. And usually, oh, yeah. if, if you're Jigglypuff, since you can die at a very low percent, trading's no good. He, all, all he had to do was just do a full hop knee right there, just because she DI'd him. Yep. So, yeah. Lots of different options. And now since every Ooh. oh, as much as since every percent, every percent is critical against Puff. She dies so early. But, Absolutely. Uh, you want to get on a lot of percent as early as possible. But this is actually the Smash Four rule set: six minutes, two stocks each. <laughs> oh wow! Wow, that actually lined up quite well. I didn't even. I guess we are watching Smash Four. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's Puff and Puff. DI yeah, so the platform. That's good DI by Agla. That, that up air from Puff is so Ooh, scary. Nice Thomas. pound. Oh, and he, he didn't seem to know what to do at that, bump, at that moment. All right, so it looks like Aglet's been having a lot of success when he's able to get thumbs over to either side of the either stage side? and box him yeah. out sideways. Yeah, he's doing and it kind of makes sense, right? Because we were talking about how uh, Thumbs Way Up is playing that scoop from underneath yeah, yeah. or like aerial warfare from above. So since you don't have the top platforms when you're off to the side, it makes he's, he yeah, he's, a lot of he's options. A, he's very vulnerable. Yeah, it makes a lot of sense for Aglet to try to like... Nice space. Oh, nice power shoot. Yep. Yeah. yeah, he's kind of just standing towards the ledge. He has no reason to go in. He's yeah, just getting a lot of free percent off back airs. Yeah, because I think Puff is like fine over there. What she really doesn't want is for the top platform to be part of the mix-up game. Yeah. Yep, the rest will finish it off. You know, Thumbs Way Up, I guess, was dash dancing really close to Aglet for yeah. a large portion of that game, so the up tilt made a lot of sense to catch him. That was a, definitely a good read. Yeah, you know what I really like is that he saved it for like an important moment when it would kill, when it would yeah, secure we the game. We did not see a lot of that during the match. That was really smart. I didn't see him up tilt once before that. Wow. He's calculated. Well, they're in Massey. Now they're coming out a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> he, he saw it works. He's like, I should do this. Yeah, yeah. yeah I see. And you know what I find to be funny is... Uh, we were talking about how Thumbs Way Up was using that top platform and uh, lower, like, see? Ooh, yeah, nice. kills him early. and the lower stage, like, dichotomy in order to pressure Aglet either from above or below, but he picks a stage without a top platform. Yeah. Now, I do know this is by far Thumbs Way Up's favorite stage. I kind of picked okay. him here one time. Big mistake. <laughs> that was a long time ago. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh that's a nice crouch. It gets the lights off stage now. Yeah big, yeah, big combo that does finish off the stock. I feel like that roll is so dangerous. If you're a little low, you just uh, yeah, bounce that, off, right? Yeah, if you're a little low, you just go right off. I don't mean, I don't exactly see. Oh, that's a good boost. Yeah, I think he's alive. But he's, he's no, nope. yeah, no punish, right? Nope. <laughs> good, just another straight up grabs him. Couple up airs. All he's that off percent. The wow. And another quick stock by Agler. Yeah, I think Great job once he gets him off the ground. You're right, like, no top platform. That's 
I mean, no way to get out of those. I mean, I, nice, I assume nice he could guy. still like jump over or something, but he needs to figure something out that's a little different. Yeah. It. Yep. There's another. Yep. Yeah, another down throw. He's, he's pretty good at those. That's good. You yeah, it's really important. One, you gotta at least have one kill set up. I have to say, uh, the first couple stocks that Aglet got, it seemed like Thumbs Way Up was not fainting an approach enough. Like when he was going in, it looked like he was definitely committing. And I think that's how Aglet got some of those big combos. Okay, so now he's yeah, mixed. Yeah. It seems like he so recognized yeah, he's, that. He's mixing up just a little bit. Nice timing mix ups, you know? Yeah, like a lot do of an, timing e mix an extra little dash dance. Or, uh, that's a knee. Yep. That kills. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Oh, wow, I think yeah, he, he really wanted to go in there and just get him. I feel like but, he might have uh, been able to rest the roll. Do you think so? Rest the roll. It's a good question. In. It looks like he was like in the right space. I don't know. We'll probably have to see it again. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, no worries. It was a fast game. Yeah. I really like how he stomped. Oh, he went for the rest. Oh, you. <laughs> I like how he stomped, and he like drifted behind him, because Puff oh, like, yeah, you yeah. Know, is going to have a hard time. You can't get the grab if you're uh, behind. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Falcon should just be able to shield if she tries to do anything. Oh, that's another rest. This up tilt, putting in a lot of mileage for uh, Agra. Yeah, he's ended both games that way. That time it looked like he traded like a Nair or something um, in order to get that. Going back, back. Right. Uh, it's a sensible choice. It, look, it looked like he was doing all right there. Yeah, I mean, he just needs to change a few things up. I mean, he traded out the top platform, like we mentioned, and it's not like he was abusing it. It just seemed like uh, just, it was it was a good he was tool. utilizing it. Yeah. So I want to see if he can employ that same strategy of like getting under or going over Aglet on stadium. Yeah, those up airs are nice, especially for that sort of place. That scoop, right? Yeah, the scoop. Oh, just a raw knee. Gets him. Wasn't expecting it. Now, this is where, if you're a full stock up like this, oh. <laughs> I was going to say you can break away and get a huge lead. Oh, that was a really nice tech to the left. And Aglet is so composed that he can just crouch there, like, reading and try to get a huge punish off of it. Goes for the red, just... That was good DI from Aglet. No, no extra percent. There. That was smart. So that dash deck back. I knew he was going to go for another hit. See, now he's so high, he was almost running out of jumps. But you know what? Puff's aerial drift is so good, I kind of like Thumbs Way Up's decision to just go back and get the middle of the stage. Yeah. Ooh, that's good. The mount transformation coming. Let's see how that messes with you. Another down throw knee. And it's... Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he likes this stage just because the side platforms are a little bit smaller. Because he's getting a lot of mileage off of those down throw knees. That's true. And you know what? I bet it makes it a lot easier to hit them because it's hard to like land on them when you get yeah, down thrown, right? Absolutely. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, they're probably going to wait it out, kind of. But yeah, you know, if you're, setting up a wall. if you're thumbs way up, like you don't have much to lose. You're already at kind of like if you get comboed, you die percent. So well, if you like can just hangs out there, I mean, you can tech. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, I would just kind of try to do something because if you can trade some percent, you still have a lead. Yep. I mean, that's obvious, but you know, against the floaty, <laughs> keeping your lead, playing oh, your lead is so important. absolutely. It's so important. Oh, that was... That's a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah. I mean, so against a lot of characters, you're like, oh, 50 damage, sure. But against Puff, against like, Puff? she can die now, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, three up airs. Just one grab, and it's probably the stock. And that's why uh, people like Agla play on a Razor's Edge. Wow, run up shield. That's ballsy. Yeah, right there. Great down throw knees. That's what I'm say. See how Agla finishes the edge card. Nice and simple. Go ahead and get him. But 150%, I don't know if that's the kind of percent you want to be killing Falcon at, especially as Jigglypuff. No, he's a tank, but he should be easily edge guardable for Jigglypuff, right? Ooh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, he's going to live that one, but one more will certainly do it. The big pound. Okay, he. Oh, he, nice crouch. Yeah, but he just meant to turn around, grab, not dash, Shoggy. grab. And, uh, well played by Thumbs Way. Yeah, he was a lot more elusive that match, I thought. Oh, absolutely. And Aglet's not. I mean, yeah, he's spacing heavy like any Puff is, but he's sort of like willing to make anti his opponent plays. He doesn't only do safe stuff. If he gets like an idea of how you're playing, he will try to take full advantage. Um, yeah. So if you're not playing elusively, he's going to like sort of pull you in like. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like, a, like Yin Yang, and then push you back out. <laughs> yes, Chad, yeah. it is Yin Yang, not Yin Yang. Interesting. Study, I didn't know that. Study Taoism. 
<laughs> that actual symbol is called the way we win. If this is the time for <laughs> Smash, not for philosophy. Yeah, okay. Wow, nice. Uh, the shield, the shield drop. drop. Yeah, the shield drop up air. Yeah, because it looked like a really bad situation, like an up tilt would scoop him, or maybe an up air from Jigglypuff, short hop up air. You know, actually, I, I think I agree. Well, no, I guess it's not his pick, but I definitely think that um, he could definitely use those shorter platforms when they're lower, because shield drop up air covers a lot of space really quickly. Yeah, and like we said, Puff in a, on a stage like this is going to sort of hang out in that like short hop to full hop range a lot. You see Aglet sort of short hopping yeah. by the side. And um, now he's using the short platforms to his advantage. As a matter of fact, ooh, it seems like Aglet was staying a little farther back so that Falcon wouldn't be able to utilize the side platforms as a mix up on his approach. Like he's yeah, staying under the platform and keeping Thumbs Way up in the center. Ooh. Sort of opposite and what we saw out of it. Oh, that was nice jab reset. Good punish. Taking that stock. Yeah, Aglet poised to win this. Needs one more stock. Ooh, wow. Amazing laid up there. If Thumbs Way Up gets 34% off of one conversion, a couple more of those, and he'll find himself back in the game. Missed that dash back. There's that up air again. Gets underneath him. Okay, yeah, that up tilt was so scary. <laughs> that's yeah, so there's actually a call the Thumbs Way Up smash. He's known for yep, that. Yep, that's it. Nope, nope. Oh, I would have just to get out of it. Gets over him. You know, I've seen Aglet offstage rest a few times. I thought he was going to do it. What oh, else? nice read on the roll in. Yep. Yeah, good I job, Agla. Agla looking damn good. <laughs> <laughs> With that jiggly puff. Dang. Yeah. I have to ask you, what's, what's your favorite puff costume? Puff costume. Which one do you use? What's her puff 